So hello people. Cece, you want to say something? No. <laughs> She's being shy. So hello guys and welcome to my channel. This is Nisi. If you're not already a subscriber, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and welcome back if you're already a subscriber. Guys, thank you so much for all the support you have been giving me. So thank you very much. So guys, today we're going to be cooking me and Cece. We're going to cook. So we're going to be cooking some pop chow my way I did do pop chow maybe one time before maybe five times <laughs> but I'm gonna do it again and show you guys how I um, do it so I'm gonna be doing the pop chow and I'm gonna put some of this in there is a pullet fillet some kind of fish because sometimes you can't get sawfish in America. Or it's too much money. So you go this way and you use this. So guys, we're going to get started and cook some nice food. And if guys, if you're a vegetarian or vegan, you don't have to use this. You could take that out. I'm trying to be a vegan slash vegetarian. But I can't just jump into it. You know what I mean? I have to take my time gradually go into it. But this is a meal that I always cook. Always eat. My dad always used to cook this for us. So we always eat it. So we're going to get started with it. thing I'm going to be doing is get my palette out. And I'm going to boil off the salt. So first, I'm just trying to get off as ex I'm trying to get off as lot of the salt I could possibly can. And even though these things say it's even though these things say it's fillet, sometimes I find one and two bones in there. So be careful. So that's it. I'm going to boil it to get off some of the water. So let's get on with the pop chow. So first you want to clean it real good because it tends to have dirt. And Cece's over there being a good little girl while mommy cook. Right Cece? Cece. Yeah, I'm being good. She having her orange and she's being good. So this is how you want your pop chow to look. And the salt fish is here and I'm just draining off the salt water. And I'm gonna boil it for a second time. So let's make some dumplings. I'm using whole wheat flour. And I don't want to make too much.
and put two stick of butter in there and let it steam real low okay let's put it on three so i'd have to take out the pumpkin because they were already cooked <laughs> and that, the butternut squash i put in late so it's not cooked as yet and with the yam and the dumpling it's not gonna be mush like the pumpkin so that's why i take them out and here goes my pop chow i'm gonna let it steam some more it's just slowly steaming and it sweats so much water but i like it real soft so i'm just gonna let it stay there and steam some more so the pop chow is perfect it's soft and tender just the way i want it So dinner is served. That's how the food looked, guys. I hope you guys try this and tell me how you like the pop chow. The other stuff, I know that's simple to do. Jamar want to say something. Guys, look at my mom gave me. give me one dumpling, one chicken. Man, you think I'm going to starve. Okay, get skinny. I don't need to get skinny. All right, this wasn't really about Jamar, but you want to oh, be okay. in it. So let's taste the food together, guys. Thumbs up, thumbs down. That's good. <laughs> Jamar. But you have kids. Uh -uh. I didn't want this video to be all about me alone. Here come my two Nine children's. Um, that one over there so guys bye and if you're not subscribed to my channel go ahead and do so and give this video a thumbs up remember i'm trying to reach the 1000 subscriber so please help me to get to that goal so guys i see you in my next video and bye bye, bye.